Yeah. Hey. Cool. Yeah. Now we all so turkey, so sunburned, finding love at the base of the bottle. Now, I'm saying. now we all been hurt, trying to make some shit work with a promise of a better tomorrow. Now, I'm saying. Say we all been hurt, all the lessons we done learned, baby, we can make it work. Say we all been hurt, all the lessons we done learned, baby, we can make it work. I like, yeah. That's the way that I'm feeling. Smoking out on a bitch, living life without a ceiling. Cause it's me and you. So let's get started with the materials list. I will be using Agilis all-purpose foam cleaner for this video. The reason I picked this is because it comes with a really nice brush on it and it works very, very well. So you can purchase this with the link in the description. Just make sure to peep that out. One thing that I wanted to mention though is that we will not be using this hard bristle brush for the uppers. We will use this strictly for the midsoles. So make sure you do not use that for the uppers. What we will be using for the uppers is this very soft, bristle brush and this is also from Angelus Direct. You could go ahead find that in the description like I said. And lastly, we will need a very clean soft rag just to dry it up and wipe it down when we're done with it. To make sure that the process is thorough, it's very good to just unlace your shoes, make sure everything is clean. Make sure you shake up the bottle really well. When you're ready, go ahead and spray it on the midsoles and get to scrubbing. It's very, very easy. At this moment, you notice that pink right there? I was kind of freaking out, but I kind of figured that it was probably something underneath the material that affected it when it got wet. But anyways, um, that just happened, so uh, we could work around that. Just let that dry and it'll come right off. But as you guys can see, the midsoles are super clean, coke white. Um, and we're just gonna do that same process to the uppers. We're gonna spray it down, use our soft bristle brush for the uppers, and then just keep it moving. This step is extra because some people's shoes will be already clean after that point of just rubbing it down. But this pair had some stains on it, so what I did was I grabbed baking soda, a little Chinese bowl, and what we're gonna do is create a paste. Now this paste is going to whiten the shoes up if they need whitening, and it will also remove any stains that are on the shoe. So I thought that this was a really nice method to use for this particular pair, being that they weren't completely white and they did have some stains on it. And once you get that paste ready, all you do is just apply it to the sneaker. You're gonna apply it in circular motions, make sure that it's all even, all on the sneaker, so then you can get the best possible results when you do this. And after you're done running through the sneakers, they're gonna look like all dry, crusty, and disgusting. Let that sit for about a day, let it dry on there and get all crusty, okay? Just let that dry overnight, and then we will move into the next step. All you're gonna do is just brush that crustiness off. It's gonna look like powder, some straight up cocaine. As you do this, the shoes will look way more white, way more clean, real nice. So there you guys have it, man. That's basically how you get the uppers of your Vans super white. And we're going to continue with doing the laces in a little bit. Memories right here, man. I think this was my first video doing the, the lace job. And I was doing this in the same setting that I did in my first video. So I thought that this was like a major throwback. All we're doing in here is throwing in the laces with some bleach and some hand soap in hot water 
and we're gonna let that sit. Basically, when you're done, you're just gonna dry it off, lace up your kicks, and they'll be looking like this. If you guys like this video, please hit that like button. It does go a long way. I know that this one was kind of a different style because I'm doing the voiceover right now, but if you guys like it, man, let me know in the comments down below. Catch you guys next time. It's your boy Sneakerhead in the Bay. I'm out. Peace. I'm just hoping I'm making the right decisions Cause I learned that even the right choice will come with consequences I'm up a cut and repercussions if they ever present it Now as a present I'm just trying to shut my guests with whoever down with me sharing shit Whoever wanna listen Bun told a young nigga keep pushing I'ma keep moving y'all can keep looking But it's all good It ain't all good but it's all good I said it's all good It ain't all good but it's all good But it's, but, but, but it's all good it ain't all good, but it's all good. I, 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 I said it's all good.